Hi everyone! From strange shapes and sizes to a diamond strawberry delight, here are the most expensive fruits in the world. Buddha pears. While this one is not the most expensive, it is a little pricey and very unique. A farm in China is now producing pears that are shaped to look like the lucky Buddha. These pears have become massively popular in both China and Vietnam, and they were first created by a Chinese farmer in 2009. These little pears look exactly like Buddha, complete with a bald head, a sublime expression, and arms folded over his chest. And while you may be wondering how on earth this is possible, it's not magic. These Buddhas can grow because the pears are grown inside a special mold. The farmer got the idea from a story of a magical fruit in the shape of Buddha and whoever ate it would gain immortality. A lot of people thought these pears were photoshopped, but you can actually eat this tiny Buddha yourself for about $9. It's the cheapest fruit on this list, so you can start munching on one while I tell you about the rest. The pear Buddhas are simply too cool. They are hugely successful and not that difficult to make. You could probably try to grow your own fruit or vegetables into different shapes, and Buddha is not the only figure. A company in China makes fruit molds of all shapes for watermelons, cucumbers, and tomatoes. It makes you wonder when human-shaped fruit will come to North America. And who exactly is the fruit going to look like? Brazilian Red Pineapples The Brazilian Red Pineapple is one of the rarest pineapples in the world. It is typically found in tropical climates, mostly in the Amazon. Red pineapples can be found growing in the monsoon season as they require lots of water to grow and produce edible fruit. You rarely see these pineapples being sold in the grocery store, though you can find them at gardening shops selling for about 25 bucks a piece. I've never seen one though, have you? They're more for decorative plants than fruit for eating. Though the Brazilian red pineapple does contain large amounts of vitamin C and other healthy nutrients and minerals. The reason the pineapple has a red skin rather than yellow is because of a certain phytochemical that gives it intense antioxidant properties. Even though this plant is almost entirely decorative, you can still eat it raw or cooked. That said, you probably won't find anyone adding any red pineapple to their holiday salad. Sakai Itchy Apples Imagine going to a supermarket and buying an apple, but when you go to pay for it, they charge you $21. Their name, which is Japanese, translates to the best in the world. You can find these in specialty shops in Japan, and they come washed with honey and branded meticulously by hand to ensure they are free of any blemishes. These apples are so great and delicious, they'll charge you over $100 for half a dozen of them. They grow in orchards in which the apples are pollinated by hand by workers using a tiny wand. This is actually not that surprising considering how obsessed Japan is with expensive fruits. There are lots of fruit salons like these where you can find all kinds of ridiculously expensive fruits. Japan does not beat around the bush. Apples are one of the cheapest fruits that they have for sale in these strange luxury boutiques. Believe it or not, there are many farms in Japan that treat their fruit better than some farms treat their livestock. You can find farmers who go through the most extreme measures to boost the flavor of their fruit, to ensure flawless presentation, and to brand their fruit using stencils. A super cool fact is that these fancy salons aren't really a grocery store. These are gift stores. Between 80 and 90% of its products are bought as gifts, since in Japan there is a custom of giving high-end fruits as gifts. What about you? Would you like to receive fruit as a gift? Let me know in the comments below. Decoponds as you will soon come to see, the Japanese dominate the market when it comes to the most expensive fruits in the world. The Dekopan is a Japanese hybrid mandarin and orange, basically a mix between a delicious little mandarin and a normal orange. They are also claimed to be the most delicious citrus fruit on the entire planet, and they are not only reserved for the Japanese anymore, as these unique hybrid fruits are now making their way into North America. These citrus fruits are easy to peel, they don't come with any annoying seeds, and they melt in your mouth like an orange ice cream. These feel like genetically modified fruit tailored just for your eating pleasure. They have a perfectly balanced pulp that's not too sweet but not too bitter, right on the spot. They also have a flavor that lingers in your mouth and makes you want to keep eating more and more. If you happen to be in Santa Monica, you can pick up some of these fruits at the local farmer's market at only about $80 for six. That's right, a full dozen of these bizarre orange and mandarin hybrids will cost you nearly $200. Victorian Pineapple it is now time to talk about the most expensive pineapples in the world. While the pineapple is definitely a tropical fruit, it is not exotic anymore. You can pick up pineapple in a can, in a jar, and a carton of juice at any supermarket in the world. However, in England, specialty pineapples are growing, which are estimated to be worth around $1,600 each. That is a seriously expensive pineapple. 
According to an article by the Huff Post, the method in which these pineapples are grown is extraordinarily peculiar. The pineapples are grown in Cornwall, England, at a place called the Lost Gardens of Heligon. The employees of this garden use outdated Victorian techniques to grow their pineapples to perfection. These techniques involve growing the pineapples beneath mounds of straw, manure, and, you guessed it, horse urine. Supposedly, this is a combination which stimulates a special chemical reaction so that the pineapples can grow in extremely cold climates. Even though the pineapples don't come into direct contact with the horse urine or manure, it is still pretty gross. It takes roughly two years for the pineapples to grow to ripeness. However, don't expect to find any of these pineapples in your local store, as they are not really for sale. $1,600 is just an appreciation of what the labor would cost. Would you still want to try one? Let me know in the comments below, and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Densuke Watermelon Everybody loves a good watermelon. They are juicy, full of nutrients, and a real treat on a hot summer day. But have you ever tried a black watermelon? Turning once more to Japan, let me introduce to you the Black Densuke Watermelon, a unique melon grown only on the northern island of Hokkaido in Japan. This is significantly less appetizing to look at than its green cousin. The Densuke watermelon has a completely black outer shell and looks more like a cannonball than a watermelon. Each of these melons can cost around $100 to $150 in a normal department store, but the record for the most expensive black watermelon ever sold was upwards of $6,000. This absurd piece was paid for at an auction. According to The Guardian, the man paid 650,000 yen for it, which equals just over $6,000. The auction took place on the opening day of the annual watermelon season, and it has become the priciest watermelon ever sold. It weighed 17 pounds and likely tasted delicious. Even though the bid for this fruit was pretty insane, it was likely done to draw attention to this art form of creating the perfect watermelon. It's all about quality over quantity. Ruby Roman Grapes there are hundreds of different grapes cultivated all over the world, and many of them are cultivated in Japan, not in Rome like its name might suggest. There is one particular variety of grape that is so expensive they sell for several hundreds of dollars per grape. I am talking about hundreds of dollars for an individual grape, not just for a bunch. These are the Ruby Roman grapes, and they were first developed in the Ishikawa Prefecture of Japan. The history of these grapes dates back to 1995, and since then, researchers have been selectively breeding the grapes to enhance their size, color, taste, and ease of cultivation. Today, these grapes are considered national Japanese treasures. For example, each grape in the bunch must weigh at least 20 grams and have a sugar content of at least 18%. There is also a premium class that must weigh at least 700 grams per bunch. In simple words, they must be perfect. But like everything else, these grapes have been marketed. Ruby Roman grapes can now be obtained for $26 per grape, and the most expensive bunch ever sold has an impressive figure of $11,000 containing 26 grapes at around $420 each. At this point, purchasing Ruby Roman grapes is more of a status symbol than an actual culinary preference. After all, what can you do with 26 grapes that cost you $11,000? Yubari King Melons If you thought we were done with Japan or with expensive melons, you were wrong. The most expensive melons in the world are considered the Yubari King Melons. This melon is grown in a place called Yubari, on the northern island of Hokkaido in Japan. As you have learned by now, Hokkaido appears to be the epicenter for growing expensive fruit. The Yubari King Melons are praised for having perfectly smooth skin and perfectly round bodies. They look quite similar to normal melons, but the orange color on their insides is truly perfect. Even four different grades are depending on the sweetness of the melon. If the melon is not sweet enough, it can be rejected. These melons also need to be consumed very quickly after they are harvested from the ground. It is recommended to consume them within three days of the harvest, and as you can imagine, it is no ordinary harvest. Harvesting these melons is done by hand with a pair of scissors. If you are ready to be astounded by the price, a typical pair of Yubari King melons sells for around $250. But in 2017, there was a pair of melons that sold at an auction for quite a bit more than that, very similar to the black watermelon that was sold for $6,000 but the price of these melons puts the black one to shame. The most expensive Yubari King melons were sold as a pair for $27,000. Northern Territory Mangoes It's time to up the ante yet again. Expensive Japanese melons are one thing, but what about expensive mangoes from the Northern Territory of Australia? Well, there are two particular records of recent sales in Australia that will blow your socks off. In 2013, a single tray of mangoes was sold at a Sydney market auction for $30,000, and the year before that, a similar tray of mangoes was sold for an outstanding $50,000. 
Of course, this is an auction to raise money for a good cause, the Prostate Cancer Foundation of Australia. Still, these completely ordinary mangoes deserve a place as some of the most expensive fruit in the world. Interestingly enough, the very first auction was held in 1970 where the first tray of mangoes was sold for $65. If inflation is any clue, 10 years from now the first tray of mangoes from every harvest will be selling for millions of dollars. Would you buy a mango tray for this incredible price? What if it was for a noble cause? Tell me about it in the comments below. Strawberries Arnaud How about strawberries with a side of a diamond? This dish, served at the famous Arnaud's restaurant in the New Orleans French Quarter, cost an estimated $1.4 million according to NBC News. The strawberries were nothing spectacular, except that they were garnished with a unique 4.7 carat pink diamond ring. And not just any diamond ring either. It once belonged to an extremely famous English financier named Sir Ernest Cassell. This strawberry dessert came complete with a side of $24,850 Charles X Crystal Cave Lacquer. It also came with the performance of a live jazz ensemble, and yes, this is certainly the most expensive fruit in the world so far. Thanks for watching. Can you believe these prices? Which of these ultra expensive fruits would you like to try? Tell me in the comments below. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.